it's a lot of youngsters shining right now. Okay. I just mentioned the baby, little baby, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of youngsters in Miami that's doing their thing. I'm looking forward to get on this platform as well. So it's most definitely creative. Morning glory, morning glory. Get up off your big lazy ass and just know they want you to be late. Punctuality is one of the greatest signs to a great leader of the weakness in the circle. Who late and who always late? Whoever always late is your biggest threat. I was just asked, Rose, for a man so wealthy, what's your most valuable asset? That's real easy. That's my family. That's real easy. It should be boring if I ain't have my family. I wouldn't even give a f But it's my family without a doubt. Then what's next? My hustle, my lack of fear. Um, that's it. Anything else, it don't matter. And where I come from, I come from Miami. Miami different. You, 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 at an early age, you lose all sense of fear because you see the biggest get knocked off by nobody. Then you see a big take time out and go and harm a lord. Oh, that's how it go. Ain't no way you could balance it. You just got to be ready. Oh, I, I'm ready. I'm ready. You ready? Question I was just asked. Rose, would you rather be loved or feared? It ain't nothing to think about. I'd rather be feared. Because if me and my homies walk in your in town and we feared, we're going to sit at the table and we're going to eat without a question. But if we walk into your town and we love, we're going to have to beg for mercy. Maybe be patient. Maybe ask for a slice of bread and then we're going to have to kill everybody in the town to take the bread. So just give me the fear off the rip and we won't have to hurt nobody. It's time for y'all to learn from others' mistakes, baby. That's what reading books is all about. Learn from the losses and experiences of others and apply to your shit. Let's go turn this shit all the way up. Be great. Be amazing, because you amazing. I ain't just telling you this. I ain't know Rose was going to be the number one biggest boss in the game. But guess what? Rose ain't stopping. I ain't done yet. Are you a businessman? And if so, how much of a businessman are you? To be a businessman, you ain't even got to own a business. To be a businessman, you could be the supporter of a business. To become a businessman, you could support the homie who owned the business. You could be the number two man and be the most valuable on the team. That doesn't necessarily mean you'll be the most wealthiest, but you could be the most valuable. And the difference is with the money who own the business, not being able to run the business without you. That's when you become the most valuable. When the most valuable can't run it without you. One of the things I'm most proud of was the question, and I'm going to say this third annual Rick Ross Car Show, which is going down June 1st. Why? It had nothing to do with music. Why? It had nothing to do with money. Why? It had only thing to do with love and passion for cars. We made this happen. The streets made this happen. Now, this is the biggest car, the biggest black car event in the country. And we're doing it totally independent. We're doing it all by ourselves. Just amazing partners, amazing friends, amazing car builders. And the fans of the culture. That's why we number one. June 1st is going down. Get your tickets right now. RickRossCarShow.com. Better beat me there. Don't meet me there. See? It's that side of Rosé. You don't want to put you in there and have Nelson and fall back with you. You don't roll over on your face, niggas. Oh. So...